Hi, this is Chuck Oliver. Welcome to this week's Hidden Wealth Solution Review. Well, I want to talk to you about retirement and tax catch-22s. First one's going to be on retirement related to the economy because the big growth number or slowness number, as it was predicted by CNBC less than 24 hours before the number was reported, with very, very toned down negativity with more concerning or discerning that the likelihood is a very poor fourth quarter. So the gross domestic product is a gauge of what growth or slowness or sluggishness or uh, rebounding of our economy is producing. Um, and lo and behold, less than 24 hours later, the same news outlet, CNBC, came out and talked about just an amazing right, report of gross domestic product, folks. This is a catch-22. Because it's very clear, the same network that was trying to gauge and, and you know, kind of, how would you say, uh, prepare, right, to, to kind of the downplay in preparation of just really the sluggishness of the economy, all the layoffs and all the things that the, the government bot media doesn't report, um, they sugarcoated. And then they, on the opposite side, came out and talked about how robust it is. Well, that's catch-22 effects, right? Uh, you know, Catch-22, which I, I, I think a lot of people miss, right, is a difficult situation in which the solution to a problem is impossible because it's also the cause of the problem. Well, if our economy is really slowing down because inflation has a little bit of impact on that to get the Fed to stop raising interest rates, a lot of times the market cheers that. But also it causes concern for maybe not a lot of growth and people counting on companies to be you know grow and be profitable so that obviously our stocks and the performance of the growth of our retirement accounts do well. That's a catch-22. We want lower inflation, but we still want good economic growth. And then the catch-22 on the flip side is to come out with this absolutely made-up number, which everybody knows it was made up, like most of the numbers that are made up by this administration, especially the irony in a, an election year that the economy is doing outstanding, basically. And what's that mean? Well, all of a sudden the market rallied and then it pulled back because then the catch-22 is, okay, but if the things are doing that well, then that means inflation really hasn't been, you know, subdued. Well, folks, the second catch-22 are taxes. So ironically, the same network, right, comes out and talks about what, how great Bidenomics are and came out and said, hey, a lot of retirees drawing Social Security, maybe for the first time or those that have been drawing for a while, are in for a tax hit because the last two years have accumulated over 12% Social Security cost of living increases. And yet the threshold that determines when, they, when you, you get taxed on your Social Security has never been inflation adjusted since its creation, going all the way back to 1984. Folks, that's a catch-22 I've ever seen it. Many of you, which we work with, go to retirementprotected.com, retirementprotected.com, want to really see like this transition from the accumulation phase to the distribution phase and what the impact is going to be long-term as it relates to risk, risk in the market. Uh, risk in inflation, risk in, in taxation, risk in market deterioration. And by studying and, and being able to analyze what you're doing and what you could be doing better are the things that you can control. And I'm going to teach that, that this Tuesday where you can actually take back control of your retirement, remove your retirement and taxes from these catch-22s and focus on three things. Tax elimination, outfoxing inflation, and removing unnecessary market deterioration. Folks, you've worked hard for your money. Stop the catch-22s, because if there's ever an administration that tells you one thing and the polar opposite is having an impact or will have an impact, like inflation and growth, folks, we've got crazy inflation. We have stagnant growth at best, and you've got people coming out, and all the economists, the, the consensus from the economists were that it was very sluggish and very slow fourth quarter growth. So once again, who do you believe? Control who you can believe being you. Get the facts, see the math, and avoid retirement tax catch-22s. Here's to your hidden wealth.